Good hello, you two friends, and welcome to Alex's Plays. Uh, dead, uh, cells. Uh, yes, I like the Spike Sword, I seem to remember. We're gonna play, oh, I was not long ago saying how, wow, I wish we could play on the castle more often on daily runs, because then we get to practice against those enemies. Let's go the way I was going, even though there's five pointers there. Remember, not really massively interested in, uh, um, points to begin with, because... Nice. That phase. Oh, we need to unlock that. Um, because I'm kind of bad at the game, so expecting to be getting good on points without actually, you know, <laughs> being a point-getting machine, it seems like folly. Very well. Because we get to do this over and over again, I will, I will, 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 I shall, I intend to. Wait, what does that do? I intend to open this because if it's terrible, corrupted power. Uh, I can just not do it next time. Adds damage. Colourless. Take 30% damage. But you get deeps and it burns. So I don't know if the burn is whilst it's active or... No, it's just a general burn. Salute. Um, because, you know, a, a good burn is hard to come by. I realise, now I think about it, that I have in fact... Uh, taken the, the the cursed chest on a run I'm particularly bad at. Not a run, a, a level. But we seem to be doing okay, actually, so let's not uh, jinx that or screw it up in any way. We know about this one as well now, so let's see what's in it. Uh, honestly, I don't know if the attack power is necessarily worth it, especially if we have Swarm. I feel like I know better how to use a grenade than I do how to use... Um, so sort of just essentially a buff, uh, an activated buff. Where is the teleporter that gets me into there? It's probably down there. Okay, I've taken some time. Uh, I, I genuinely do not know whether I prefer the effect that came out of the uh, the, the 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 cursed chest, which we did manage to uh, survive somehow against all odds, which is many odds when you're playing. As me, and when I say playing as me, I mean, you know, when you are me, I'm obviously playing as the unnamed uh, prisoner Maduda, who is the Dead Cells guy. Nobody knows, okay? There is literally no way anybody could possibly know the lore of Dead Cells. Here, have this. Oh, I forgot you could just keep checking fighters out and, you know, let it be. Nice. Anything good down here? Probably. Ah, uh, this run is amazing for some reason. Can you not hurt me? Um, I don't feel like I've done anything to deserve this run being so good. Because it's not like I started off with a, a, an excellent run that needs... What? <laughs> what happened? Um, you know, why, why am I stomped so good? Why is there an elite here? Please don't do anything that is an area of effect attack that means I can't attack you. You did though, didn't you? What a meanie. Heavy turret is decent. I'm not using the phaser properly, but I do like it. Do you know what? We've got such good items right now. I'm going to keep them. And there's no points for... No Was that 2B? I think that's a 2... That's a near or tomato background going on there. Near a tomato background. Where is the exit? It's up there. We know that because we found it. Uh, I'm kind of happy with what we've got. I would like a secondary weapon, but it's not killing me that we don't have one. If you notice how this one did three stomp, three stabs in the same direction. But, stop. Um, when I see those units in real life, <laughs> quote unquote real life, they, the, their final one is... If they manage to turn around to get me, if, if that's an option. If they need to. I really dislike these, um, these. See, that was good. I liked doing that, but I don't know if I did it correctly or if I just got lucky. I really appreciate the cooldown on this backstab thing. If we can get this unlocked, which I honestly don't know how we would do. Um, and then... You know, start making 
start finding it in the world, that would really synergize well with my current favorite weapon in the first place. I think we can probably beat the concierge. With this setup. No, 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 let me out. It doesn't hurt too much right now. Also, you have, <laughs> you have a bow, just shoot it. Right. Because you can reach it from that? The teleporty thing is grand, I do like it. Uh, but it does tend to teleport you into melee range of something maybe you don't want to be in melee range of. Like the whirlwind Meduda. Let's go and kill this guy. We might as well get some five extra points for it. Okay, <laughs> that went well. Good, good job, me. Look at all these splats on the ground where I've been. Wow, what? Oh, it's because I took damage recently. Open this, whilst I've still got... I've only got 10 seconds. This is not going to work. Don't waste my time like this. Just take damage and use your crits. No! <laughs> that could have worked out really well. Do I want to do the curse chest? No. I don't think... I don't, cursed power at that point could have been great. But the rest of the way around, I don't know. It doesn't seem right. It doesn't feel like it's the right fit for me. It doesn't bring me joy. It doesn't spark joy. I'm not going to uh, use this as a, a platform for bits, for, for talks, for you know, the meditative effect that we like to uh, find in our Dead Cells play. That one turned around, so it does do it sometimes. But this one didn't, okay. Uh, but... Uh, because it's just so short. It's a short one. We need to keep focused on these uh, on these old... Uh, oh, now I'm tempted to go and get Cursed Power. No, I, I like the Zappy. I like the Teleporter Zappy thing. Yeah, this one. Which I just completely forgot was directly behind me. Uh, directly in the ground. and No need to look for it. And then if we go far enough, we will find that there is... Ooh! A, uh, another weapon for us as well. Maybe I don't like the biters so much. I'm really tempted by curse power. Oh, but, uh, I'm going to get it. The biters are okay. I don't think they have helped us out as... I don't want to say they haven't helped us out as much as I think they have, because maybe they have helped us out more than I think they have, you know? Does that give you a bonus when you... Yeah, the next attack after you teleport gives you a bonus of damage. Plus, I took damage anyway, so now I have the, the crit damage, and that actually really made a big difference. But let's get rid of the swarm. I don't think we need to sell it. <laughs> that would probably be going a little bit too far. When we can go. Um, I've not been not being hit quite so much as I'd like. Um, where did we find the other weapon that we wanted? Bone Ender's Quiver was right here, wasn't it? Nearby here, anyway. Party, do this. Nice. Nope. No! I thought I rolled. Honestly, I didn't think he would fire that quickly. I think we should take the curse first, because I did well when I took the curse first um but the second time not so not so well this is already a nine minute episode so we, we're doing worse than we previously have let's try this i like both of these swords which is the problem let's grab this grab this take it okay don't grab this roll hello the stun locks in this game do do cause salt i'll be honest with you there ah uh, but just don't get... Don't, don't let them... Do you know what? We should ignore these for now so that we can shoot them on the way back. Oh, no, we don't want to do that because there's a teleport. Just... I'm just pulling apart these, uh, these ideas and concepts. We have to figure out the best way of making this work for us. And the best way of making this work for us is not getting hit. I used... I pressed LTRT, but I don't think RT was ready 
<laughs> need to press LT. Don't like the blood sword as much as the spiteful sword, to be quite honest with you. Load fast. Just restart the level. Probably being internet-y, you know? Let's grab this. Then we'll go this way. Then we'll do this. Probably helps too. And then we'll grab this. Grab this. Hi. Stop. Why are those ones allowed to hit me? They're not even on the screen. I think there should be a statute of limitations on enemies not being on the screen, yet still being allowed to actually hurt me. It's a bit rude. Also, I'm playing worse now than I was when I started. I know about the gods. Right. Uh, switch these. Keep pressing X instead of Y. I don't know which one's which. It's just muscle memory as to which one I want to press. Uh, we're not going to get the biters this time. That's the idea. Nice. Why am I doing so much damage? What was that sound? Mm. Wasn't ready. Can I not teleport when I'm in the air? I think I might be getting this wrong. I was assuming that I could sort of teleport behind something. Like when I... Death from above it, but I don't think that's, that is going to work. We will check it out this time because I'm going to grab it. Also, I don't want it on RT. Stop. It's clearly an LT sort of skill. Why did you not get stunned by my amazing smash? Only one attack gets um, a bonus, unfortunately. I want this. <laughs> I think it's good. But if it's going to keep causing me this much trouble... Uh, I'm going to have to say maybe we do something else. Or just play slower. I mean, I know there's a time limit, but it's not... It's not necessarily going to be a, a massive problem for you. So take the time. Ooh. Yeah, I expected it that time. Oh, you get a little bit of power just out of doing it. That's amazing. Like, oh, that was much easier. You, uh, you gain a small amount of damage simply by teleporting in the first place. At least it seemed that much. Oh, I can teleport in here, so I don't know. Um, take that. Go. We don't want to go that way. We've got everything that we need. This is fine. Let us run. We have no curse. I could have teleported. I apologize, but I am um, one track minded so far right now in this moment. Let's beeline to the boss and make sure we've got plenty of time. We don't need points. We're not a points person. It at least seems to stun them. And the cooldown on it is amazing. Excuse me? You're not? I'm trying not to. <laughs> I'd like you to stop. Hold on. Oh, that's the end of the the power up, the start. No, stop! <laughs> the dude should have. There should be a just sort of a stagger effect that that gives to that person, right? Like um, I'm suggesting maybe uh, if the stop. I'm trying to roll, but he's just not rolling. Maybe he just refuses to roll if there's too many enemies between you and them. I don't need the XP, right? So just let it be. Um, what am I saying? What was I just saying? The the spinny attack. If the dude was just like dizzy after this, I'd be well up for that. Doesn't seem to work that way, unfortunately. <laughs> that was interesting. So in theory, I could beat the concierge without taking any damage, but I never seem to do so. Good to know the options there. Ah, uh, nearly managed it. I can take damage now, it's fine. We have won. The Meat Skewer. 10 daily challenges, thank you for playing. <laughs> thank you for joining me.
We managed that eventually. I think that was... Uh, I, I really overthought that one at the start. We just needed to pick up the right things and not die from the curse, which usually is not that difficult, but I, I, I think the difference between this time and the last time I played the castle daily is really showing. So that's, that's good progress. I think we're getting somewhere. I've already finished my cup of tea, so I think I'll call that the end of the episode. Thank you for watching and whatever's up next today, because this is a small episode, there may be two episodes today. Actually, 15 minutes, one episode today. Now, nah, I don't know. I've put myself in a position where now I have to decide. <laughs> Look, I don't know what day it is. Maybe I forget completely and you never see this one entirely. Anyway, thank you for watching. I'll see you.